Welcome back to Oxygen Frog. As always, I'm your host, Scott Fleischman, chemical engineer, scientist, and the owner of Oxygen Frog. In this video, we'll be covering the impure oxygen rejection and the active compression control, which are unique features to Oxygen Frog system. So, let's get started. The Active Compression Control, or ACC for short, is this black knob located right on the front of the Legacy. What this little black knob does is sync up the system to alleviate the potential stress that would be put on the compressor and concentrators if you did not have an oxygen frog system. On an ordinary oxygen system, the compressor will only work with a fixed number of oxygen concentrators. Since there's no way to modify the compressor size on an ordinary oxygen system, you'd have to replace the compressor to expand the size of your system. Oxygen Frog's ACC changes all that. For example, you could set up your Legacy 220 with just two 10 LPM concentrators. That's a lot of oxygen, especially for one glass blower. Consider if another glass blower, or two, or five for that matter, would like to share shop space with you. If you had an ordinary oxygen system, you'd have to change out or add multiple compressors to accommodate more oxygen concentrators. But it's not a problem with the Legacy 220. You can add as many oxygen concentrators as you wish to your system with ease. Up to a total of eight concentrators to accommodate your, shop, your new shopmate's oxygen demand. All without changing the compressor. Just simply adjust the ACC knob and it's ready to go. So let me show you how easy it is to sync your system using the ACC knob. The best time to adjust your system is when the pressure in the surge tank is between 80 and 100 PSI, and the oxygen concentrators are running just below their maximum rating. There are only two things you have to watch when adjusting the ACC, the ACC gauge and the flow meter on the oxygen concentrators. First, pull the ACC knob to unlock it, and then adjust it until it reads between two and four below zero. This is just a very slight vacuum. Then adjust the flow on the oxygen concentrators to just under their maximum. For example, a 10 liter per minute machine should be running at about nine and a half liters per minute. Then check the ACC gauge again and adjust if necessary. Repeat these steps if you need to ensure everything is balanced. The ACC is now adjusted. Great job. Finally, push down to lock the ACC knob into place. And if you ever add any more concentrators, just do this simple adjustment procedure again. It's that easy. Oxygen Frog also has an impure oxygen rejection feature to ensure you get the highest possible oxygen purity at your torch. When the oxygen system first comes on to refill your tank, the oxygen concentrators naturally produce low purity oxygen for about a minute or two. Oxygen Frog products have the specific valve to reject this oxygen back into the air and does not send it to the tank. This keeps, your, keeps the impure oxygen away from your torch and keeps your flames burning hot. If you feel a little overwhelmed because this is the first time you've seen something like this, don't be. The set of procedures we described here are actually fairly simple and if at any point you get stuck, we're always here to help. But thanks for tuning in. We hope you enjoyed watching this as much as we enjoyed making it. Follow us on Instagram, give this video a like, and subscribe to our channel for more videos.